For someone who really tries to stay out of the sun, I sure do end up on a lot of beaches. That was the goal when we stumbled into a Starwood preferred guest points deal at the Western Resort and Spa in Los Cabos, Mexico. Here's a peek at the lobby where we waited with welcome drinks in hand for someone to help us take our wheeled bags to our room. They insisted. And I soon learned why. The space between the lobby and guest rooms is a labyrinth of slim walkways, foliage, pedestrian cul-de-sacs, and stairs. Would have taken us a lifetime to get there on our own. Once we got to our partial ocean view room, we found a pair of Weston Heavenly beds, and once we got to our second room, we found they were pretty comfortable. I'll get back to that in a minute. The love seat chair thing, along with the small coffee table, was nice to have and great for entertaining. You should find plenty of excuses to not work here, but if you must, the desk is a good size for setting up shop, but the chair isn't made for long-term use and Wi-Fi isn't free. If you just have to work, then you should be impressed by the business center located in the maze leading back to the lobby. Inside, you'll find full-size cubicles and all the conveniences of a modern office. Back in the room, 27 inches. Seems a little stingy for a television when you're in a resort several miles from any kind of alternate entertainment, but you might be wiped out from hours of daytime fun to even care. Your washroom comes with a double-head shower, which in our case had disappointing water pressure, which will make it harder to wash off the many layers of sunblock you'll apply throughout the day. You'll also have a separate standard sized tub to soak in and a reasonable amount of counter space if you need to prep for a night at the resort's many bars or restaurants. You get a nice bar area in your room stocked with coffee, wines, and accessories. Your mini bar is stocked with beer, soda, more wine, tiny bottles of booze, and plenty of bottled water. Because you're in Mexico. You can even lock up your goods in the safe while you're drinking the tiny bottles of booze. Now, here's why we changed rooms. I'm deathly afraid of bringing home bed bugs from hotels, so after I collect tons of video for your benefit, I turn the room upside down making sure there's no sign of the critters. Here's what I found on one of the mattresses. While this doesn't necessarily mean there are bugs in this room and could be from something completely different, I didn't want to mess around. The hotel quickly and graciously handled a request to be moved to a different room, same layout, different floor, clean mattress. I should also note that there have been no significant complaints of bed bugs at this resort according to our sources as of this review. After that was out of the way, we were worry-free to enjoy this. Lots and lots of this. The resort's beach area was clean and mostly peaceful except for some chatty guests here and there. Starting early in the day appears to be a good idea if you want to be in the shade. The number of umbrellas is limited. If poolside is more your speed, the resort has a few of them, from family-friendly to an adults-only pool with a swim-up bar. The resort has a long list of optional activities, a handful of restaurants spread out over this and neighboring properties, and tennis, anyone? Your stay here should be a good one if you can look past the dated exterior and some shortcomings in the guest rooms. I'll fill in all the details and show you the deal we got in my text review. I'm Jake Redman at the Westin Resort and Spa in Los Cabos. Thanks for visiting Mount Hop.